Welcome back guys, I'm Andy with Money Soldiers Trades. Today we're going to be going over the TradeStation 10 platform. Let's get back into it. As you can see, I have uh, resized my charts a little bit from the last chart video. And I brought out this guy. This is, and I'll go and bring another one out, right here, quick trade bar. It's going to open up quite big here. And we want to resize it. And then we can grab that. And now if you'd like to, actually I wouldn't like to. I was going to resize it, but I'll just take take this one, put it right next to that one there. And all you, you want to do is make sure that you can see and utilize all the buttons in these. But real estate, as I have said before, is the name of the game. So let's move these over. And then resize this chart a little bit right here. All right, so getting into it, let's go and what do we want next? I think I'm gonna go with time and sales. And as always, we will be resizing this. Now, time and sales, I don't believe, anyways, one thing we can do here in the settings for the window you can change the colors if you'd like nothing we really need to do there and then go back into the settings um, columns so it's up to you what you have uh, going on but I don't need that change. Bid, ask, high, low. And back to the columns here, details. All right. Um, you can get rid of the type if you'd like, it's up to you. It's all about the size that you're gonna have going on with your with your setup here. I don't believe that we can copy this one, so what we'll do is we'll go back up here to apps and pull out another time in sales and do the exact same thing that we just did with that one. Just remove type if you'd like. Make sure you can see everything there. And again, yeah, nothing we really need to be doing in there. And if you want to, you can change the other columns as well again. It's all up to your preferences. <laughs> all right. And then something we're definitely going to need here. Let's see where we're at. Trade manager. And this one, if I can, which I'm not sure I can here, I would like to be able to fit it in there. I don't know if that's going to happen for us here, but we'll see in the settings what we can do with this window. This is for your orders and your positions. And again, we'll need to go to columns and whatever columns you need in yours. Um, we'll go through the columns in the next video for this actually. And uh, I'll let you know what I have in mind. And basically, 
so yeah that's not really going to fit too well there so if you'd like your spy chart to be that small that would be great that's fine and uh that's it for now thank you hi i'm sarah with mighty soldiers trades we really appreciate your support if you like that video please like and subscribe thanks